Welcome back, everybody, to more Stone Hearth here on additional Pons games. We're continuing our playthrough with the town of Guarbaracho. And uh, it does seem that our speedy tonic that we used at the end of last episode is working decently well. We don't have any hard things stuck on the walls, so that's good. Uh, we have massive amounts of unnecessary scaffolding going up. Hopefully we can get rid of all that scaffolding later in the build. But for now, the central tower, central pillar, seems to be going up nicely. We've got plenty of workers working away at it, and I missed a notification. But whatever. It's probably that this guy leveled up. So let's go ahead and get those, those as backups, and we can start making comfy beds. Requires a torch. So let's get one of those. Let's prioritize that. Then we can start making comfy beds for everybody. It's a nice little. Uh, I think that's new. Uh, more easier than I have never read it. That's fun. <coughs> Alright, carpenter level 4 will get the archer's bow, and we can turn our uh, Laura Creed, turn Laura into an archer. Level 3. Archer's bow. Good, good, good. This has finally been cleared out. So I think that as our troops our troop of workers keeps working away at the lighthouse, we can go ahead and rebuild the icon of the lighthouse. It's been a long time doing that. So again, we're going to... Uh, that's floor. We want blocks. I'm kind of metal. And I can't place anything. trouble, isn't it? Um, I think that the only solution then is for us to build up. So what we will do is we'll have a nice, do a nice slab like this. Actually, let's just go ahead and change this up. I'm thinking that we can do something a little bit different. Why should we have the town symbol of a lighthouse down here when there's a massive lighthouse on the to look at? It just seems redundant. Seems like a good idea at the time, right? <laughs> Isn't that the excuse? Um, Let's do one more level of good little steps.
love to do, actually. I'm hoping in the future we can do this for like some way to transport water. So I'd love to make it fun. Fun of some sort. Um, I like that. That's a little, a little race platform or something like that. And finish editing, but we'll hold off on building it. Needs one stone to build. Well, that's not right. Because it requires clay bricks. See, this hasn't updated. So. Alright. Let's take a look at. Okay. Nobody's getting stuck. This little area is. Looks like they got the diagonal area going up. <coughs> Which is good. That's the part that I was most worried about. Lots and lots of scaffolding. We'll, uh. We'll see if that all comes down. If not, then I'm hoping there's some sort of code or something like that. Some sort of... I don't know, some sort of console code or something like that I can put in to remove all the scaffolding from when it's done. Find animal goods. Not really interested. Is there anything that we can sell you? It seem like it. Thanks for coming by. To trading outpost, Gorgoncho does not want you trading goods. Third of the way up. 
much better. It's going out pretty decent so far. So we've got this building project lined up. We can let's line up. Actually, what we need to do is we need to take a ladder up here. A ladder here. Start leveling this off. We're gonna get rid of this whole area. So that way so we're gonna get rid of it, so that way when we do build out this order this next line bridge. Don't get any hard things stuck up on this side area. Just something that happened. Something that happened uh, the first couple times that we tried to build this little drawbridge. Cancel the bronze for now because we need tin ingots to build these guys. Let's go ahead or four more of those. So whenever she gets the chance, whenever the materials are available. And you know, I see that she needs bronze gears. Let's. ourselves a little bit of iron, just for gears and such that need to be created. How much steel do we have? Our inventory. That's a good question. Three steel. Okay, so that's not ten, that'll give us thirteen. are shaping up pretty nicely. Another simple merchant. Here to peddle goods that we don't actually need. It's a furniture. We can plant a bunch more trees. We might have to do that. We'll have to do that eventually. The scaffolding is going up. So proud. So proud. Nice job. <laughs> More useless scaffolding. Oh boy. Well, these little corner pieces are done. So pretty soon people are gonna be able to place those on stone braziers. A little bit of light coming from the lighthouse here. Good night. So much useless scaffolding. That's alright. It's an alpha version. That they were continued to optimize the building process, the building steps, all the functions behind it. Radiant James has been fantastic, giving us regular updates. No dangerous here. Let's take a look. There, it's not what Now we can, in fact, get 20 of these. Close up 
corner. So, he should be smart enough to create mean beds first, and then adapt them into the comfy beds. Should be. That's the key, uh, keyword. She was excited to get to sleep. <laughs> Jeez. Some days I feel like that too. Best thing about sometimes the best thing about the day can be when you just get into bed. Start over. All right. Slowly working away in our great lighthouse. Just hoping that it doesn't get stuck at some point. How many more chests do we need? Five and it's like here, so we need 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17. Seems right. seems safe and sound. I wonder how much wood is being sunk into those ladders. Fair bit. That is one, one downfall of having big building projects. One of the things that I've noticed that happens to me a lot is just a lot of, a lot of stuff just gets strewn around on the ground because, for whatever reason, I don't prioritize it. Let's go ahead and start getting rid of this stuff. So maybe we have an errant worker or something who comes up. This starts kicking off. Get done. We can also design the next drawbridge. So, so this one is just a basic square. Jesus, if I don't talk a whole lot right now. 
focus mode. Build mode. Go. Alright, training caravan returns. How can we sell them? First order of business, getting rid of a bunch of our stuff. Seem like there's a whole lot to give away. Not a whole lot we're interested in. Right Not worth it right now. Anybody's stuck. Anybody's stuck. Building them up brick by brick. Okay. Just take a look back at this. Dark brown. Um, oh yeah. I forgot. It's going to be a little bit of a pain. that we used last time. Well, that doesn't help. Clinker. Punga, I remember Punga. And we'll probably use Cocoa Brown for the other one. So let's go ahead and just use those two. See, it's really difficult with this camera angle to get down low. Let's go ahead and okay. Right. So we're gonna have to do the pillar method. So this is basically where what we do is we build a pillar up. No, it's not letting me do that. Because I need to select blocks. So what we're going to do is we're going to build up, up, up. to work off of. Basically, we're just going to work from the bottom up. A little bit shorter of a bridge, so let's go. That. Every step is three, four. our next building. Ready to go. Continue taking this stone wall area. Little carpenter level 4, that's good. That means we can build us. Yeah, archer's bow. Let's get that at the top. So we can turn our footman into an archer. As soon as we... As soon as uh, Laura. As he slash she is level three, become an archer. All right. 
So that's where we're going to wrap this episode up. Things are progressing nicely on our complex scaffolding structure, <laughs> which is supposed to be our lighthouse. We'll see if it ever gets there. Um, but we'll probably do a time lapse, a little bit of a, a time jump between this episode and next episode, allow our, our things to build on that a little bit and give us a little bit of flexibility um, for some other projects. So thanks again for tuning in for a little bit more Stoneheart here on the Digital Pilots Games. Hit like and subscribe if you want to see more. Check out some of the other series going on on the channel. Leave a comment below if you have any tips, any suggestions, anything like that. Thanks again for tuning in, and we'll see you next time here on APG. Thank you.